Some people just added a brand new ability. And I could you not, guys? It's actually not a bad ability. So I'm going to show you guys what it does and how you guys can go ahead and get it. Now, if you guys actually do want to go ahead and win one of these void pack, I suggest you guys go ahead, leave a like and subscribe. If we can get this video to 200 likes, we'll go ahead and give it away to a few lucky winners. Guys, make sure when you guys are making any new purchases on this new update, use the code unpredictable, click OK, and you pretty much are good to go. So yeah, let's get on with the video, guys. So this new ability, I shortly covered it a few days ago or maybe yesterday i think and this ability is currently called adrenaline it's a passive ability charge up an aura over time that strengthens your next parry now if you guys do want to go ahead and get this it is 8,000 coins so you guys can buy it for 8,000 and upgrade it so for the upgrade number one you guys get a second aura stage and for the upgrade number two you get a third aura stage and i'm going to show you guys that in training because it's a lot easier to show you guys on training instead of me showing you guys online where i'll be forced to parry people so now i am on training i'm going to go ahead and increase the bot to five and make them expert as you guys can see i do have the ability already equipped so that's currently five bots and it should start charging up the ability and then the next aura should appear as you guys can see on my train right now i am turning blue i'm pretty sure the next one is red then it goes purple but we'll see how long that one takes i'm not going to actually cut down the video as you guys can see now we are currently red And the next one is currently purple. As you guys can see, we are currently purple. So we are fully charged. And now we can actually hit the ball on a really fast pace. So if you guys don't know, the charge time is 45 seconds to reach the final stage, which is this stage, the purple stage. The current speed the ball goes when you guys hit it, it is raging deflex level. So it isn't truly, truly fast, but I'm pretty sure this is the max level you guys can go up to. Now, I probably won't be able to show you guys me pairing one of these bots because they just go after the same people over and over again. But yeah, as you guys can see, it literally just turns you into blue, which is the first stage. The second stage is the red stage. And the third stage is the purple stage, which is the raging deflex level. Now, I'm going to try to see online how practical this is. I don't think it's going to be insanely practical because there's just way too many people trying to kill you. I'm going to go online and check how practical it is. So currently I am online right now and we're going to check out how practical this is or how many times you guys can get hit in one single game. See, when I first saw this and my friend actually did the analytics for this, bro, I could you not, 45 seconds is way too long, especially for an ability that is passive and people could just literally go ahead and shoot the ball towards you. But as you guys can see, hopefully these guys don't shoot the ball towards me. As you guys can see, the ball is already coming towards me. So it's not a very good ability if you guys are waiting for it. Wait, it actually charges up. There we go. We charged it up a little bit. It's not not bad wait this might be actually a really good ability wait one second okay so we're charging up to the blue stage we're gonna try charging up to the red stage that's probably 30 seconds in and then the other one is 45 seconds in sadly we couldn't we had to hit it oh my god these guys are just using insane abilities this is crazy bro okay whatever i do feel like they need to go ahead and buff this just a little bit more because 45 seconds in game is kind of insanely long and i'm pretty sure 45 seconds you won't have a guy who's 45 seconds in the game who probably hasn't got hit by the ball the entire game because that's pretty much near impossible as you guys just saw this guy just went after me but the passive ability doesn't start until you guys get to the next stage which is the blue stage as you guys can see this is a normal stage you guys can go ahead and parry the ball until you guys get to the blue stage and then it will disappear so as you guys saw i was in the blue stage i just hit and it literally disappeared so you guys can keep doing that if you guys want to you guys can protect yourself so as you guys can see i'm on the blue stage it just disappeared again i mean on a standoff if you guys are fighting like infinity then it's gonna be really hard for you but if you guys are fighting like just normal people and it's very easy like mid game that would be really easy but i'm pretty sure you guys will have to go ahead and spend like eight thousand i remembered getting this yesterday so you guys will have to go and get eight thousand and then you guys will have to go get another like five seven k to go ahead and upgrade this and more and more 
until you guys get to the final stage. Well, I'm going to see if this is more practical in this server right now. So I'm slowly charging up my ability. As you guys can see, I am currently blue. The charge time between blue and red is kind of long. So I won't be able to get to the red stage quick. But yeah, really cool. I mean, the ability is pretty good. If you guys are a passive player and you guys just want to stay away from fights and you guys want to just do passive stuff, then I suggest you guys go ahead and get this ability. I mean, for 8,000, it's really cheap and also it's a free to play. So I suggest you guys do it. Obviously, I'm going to try this out on the main game to see how effective it is in the main game. Because everyone in here has just like OP abilities on the testing servers and whatnot. So it isn't really practical for me to go ahead and show you guys on the testing servers instead of the real life game, the main game, the active game. So we're actually in a game and this time we did an AFK and did the most basic rookie mistake. I'm not even kidding with you guys. So we're going to figure out everything if this is actually worth trying out and worth not trying out like i said the charge time is kind of insanely long that is the only downside to it you guys can protect yourself but if you guys are fighting against like really op abilities paid to win ones which are currently like dribble infinity and whatnot it's gonna be a hassle for you guys to go ahead and use this because it is a passive ability you guys will have to wait until you guys charge this up as you guys can see i charged it up to blue but i couldn't charge it up to red sadly and that is where it gets really hard to do is charging it up to the fullest and using it to the fullest ability now obviously still give it a try because giving this ability a try is still worth a try and maybe you guys might like it i know a lot of people that don't like tack i don't like tack because you can't protect yourself but a lot of people do like it i guess as you guys can see it does speed up the ball but it's not noticeable when you guys are on the first stage i'm slowly charging it up to the blue stage the next stage i want to charge it up is the red stage so please try not to go for me because i haven't seen the red stage yet in action bro okay i got the red stage it does go a little bit faster oh my god oh my god this guy is trying to kill me that's crazy with infinity Okay, you know what? I let him win that. Okay, so we've reached the red stage, but we haven't reached the purple stage. I'm telling you guys, the Playboy developers need to go ahead and actually make this a little bit easier to go ahead and get to the main stage. Because when you guys are fighting against like the most insane abilities in the game, it's like near impossible for you guys to go ahead and charge this up. Like, I'll even hide behind here. I just got to the blue stage. That's all I got up to is the blue stage. And they literally just went after me. That's crazy. But yeah, let me know down in the comment section what you guys think about this new ability. Do you guys like it or do you guys not? But yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.